Talk about. Tell me about the inspiration of Contrast. Okay, so Contrast is the is the kind of brainchild of our studio head and founder Guillaume uh, Provo. Um, he was he was working in Lyon about four or five years ago, and he was was really inspired by the original Portal. He loved how Portal Challenge you think about moving through space in different ways. And he used to sit in a cafe every morning. Um, he works with people in the States in the afternoon. He used to sit in this cafe and just draw ideas. Um, and he thought, just one morning, he thought, you know what, I wonder what it would be like if you could just walk up and you could jump on all the shadows in every game you could play. Uh, in contrast, that's what you can do. You can become your shadow and you can jump on the other shadows in-game. And we have built a game entirely around that mechanic. Cool. Now, the, the main two characters of the game are a little girl and, and her imaginary friend. What, what are That's their right. names? So, the little girl's name is Dee Dee. Uh, she is uh, a pretty precocious, you know, eight or nine year old child. Um, and Dawn is her imaginary friend. Um, and not to like draw out the comparison automatically, but there is a very stark contrast between the two of them. She is a very innocent little girl, even speaks with a lisp, while she's a, you know, a mid twenties, sultry looking, you know, twenties. Yeah. Uh, what do you want to call it? flapper girl almost? Yeah, yeah. We get a lot of comparisons to the flappers, um, <laughs> and which is which is great. Uh, it's really awesome. We wanted, um, we did want someone a little bit more mysterious because you know an imaginary friend is always a little bit more exciting than than the real world, and Dawn's pretty special. You'll find out um, you know, just at the start of the game what about their relationship. Uh, and she exists a little bit because uh, a little bit because Dee Dee's been abandoned. So I mean, her her mum's still there and, and she looks after them, and, you know, but she works very very hard. Uh, and her dad left the family, and so her mum is a cabaret singer. So you might be able to say that, that, that Dawn's inspired by the world that she's in and the people that Dee Dee sees. Now how long is the game about, uh, you know, in length? In length, we're looking at about four to five hours. Okay. Uh, yep, so it, it, it's a little bit, again, like Portal in the sense that some people will go through it faster than others because it is a puzzle game. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, four to five hours is about right. How far are you uh, in terms of completion? Pretty much done, actually. Uh, when are you expecting a launch? We're looking at September or October. The reason okay. uh, for the delay between now and um, there's actually a bit of a story behind this, but <laughs> as, there, as there always is. Right. Um, but the the reason is we uh, we've recently signed with Focus to bring the game to uh, PS3 and Xbox 360. Oh, great! Uh, in addition to the PC, which we already have, so we've got this great PC version. It'll also be available on Xbox 360 and PS3 uh, and the PS4. Anything for the Xbox One? So far, no. Um, that's uh, not through lack of trying. Um, it's just very much. I think. I think Microsoft's still figuring out how they're how they're going to work with Indies in the next next wee while. Um, but you know, we'll be looking into that probably in the next couple of months as well. It should hopefully be a massive change to to adopt and port to the Xbox One from PC architecture. Thanks very much. I appreciate your time. Very well.